players for when they ran by white boys anyway. And I can speak about it, nigga, because when I played, I had to shut my mouth too. There's two ways you can go, nigga. You bite the apple and wear them motherfucking dresses like uh, Russell Westbrook or whatever the fuck his name is. I don't even want to say this nigga name no more. But this ain't this nigga first time in a dress. So I don't know why people so alarmed. This nigga been wearing dresses and weird ass shit. But see, like I told you, LBJ said, your leaders, they'll give them to you. And just cause this nigga can jump high and play basketball, not nary nigga, not no Geechee nigga, not no nigga I ever was raised up with, gonna be walking around the goddamn streets with a dress on and some motherfucking boots and get my respect and say he heterosexual. Now, if you gay, cool, my cousin gay, I don't give a fuck. I got gay girl, female cousins, male cousins, it, it don't matter about that. But when you say you a heterosexual male, and that's what you do, nigga, fuck you. And that's my opinion, nigga. So if you wanted my opinion on that, I think these niggas is exposing exactly what I said. These bitch-ass celebrities bite that motherfucking apple. And I never bit no apple. I just shut my mouth. That's how you got to do it. You got to shut your mouth or bite that apple. And there's plenty of niggas like me that's just not talking. Because that weird ass shit they around is weird as fuck. What kind of nigga y'all, what hood y'all, these niggas supposed to be from? Nigga in high heel boots and a miniskirt. Nigga, the fuck wrong with you? Man, please. These are your leaders. 